A researcher wanted to determine if carpeted rooms contain more bacteria than uncarpeted rooms. The table shows the results for the number of bacteria per cubic foot for both types of rooms. We have carpeted and uncarpeted. Determine whether the carpeted rooms have more bacteria than uncarpeted rooms at the point O level of significance. It says that normal probability plots indicate that data are approximately normal and box plot indicate there are no outliers, which means we can run our two sample t-test. So state the null and alternative hypothesis. So if we let, okay, let population one be the carpeted rooms. So we are wanting to know, do carpeted rooms have more? So we're gonna, we know that the null is equals. So we know it can't be C. And it looks like we're gonna do A. The mean amount of bacteria for carpeted rooms is greater than the mean amount of bacteria for uncarpeted rooms. This is often expressed in sentences when you see these in research articles and such. Determine the p-value. So let's go ahead and run this on the TI-8384 and on StatCrunch. So let's start with the 84. Okay, so I need to first put the data in. So stat, edit. I'm gonna clear out my list. Just scroll up to L1, press clear. There's a couple other ways to do it that are possibly a little faster, but we'll just stick with this. Okay, so just start typing those numbers in. I'll come back to you in a minute. Okay, I just put the list in. So now we're gonna go to stat, test. We're doing a two sample t-test. Number four. And I'm using data, so scroll over here to data. Okay, list one is an L1, list two is an L2. Frequency is one on both of those. And we're doing mu1 is greater than mu2, which we already have. All right, that's what I said here. That'll be your alternative. We are going to stay out of the pool and press calculate. Bunch of stuff here, make sure you know what all this means. You can scroll down and see other things. So often it asks for the test statistic, 1.88. It doesn't in this case, but know that that's where it is. Here's our p-value, 0, 0.0, so to three places, so 0 0.042. Okay, let's just take a look at this. When we have the mean of the carpeted rooms at 12.075 and the mean amount of bacteria for the uncarpeted at 8.8, .8, I mean, it looks like there's a difference. It's a pretty small sample size though, right? Uh, there, there appears, you know, this is 50% more, um, small sample size, but let's see if if um, our test detects a difference. We have a pretty small p-value and we are looking at the 0.01 level of significance. So we're not gonna reject. If it had been a 0.05 level of significance, we would reject. So there is not significant evidence. So, so we don't reject. There's not enough evidence at the point on one level to conclude that carpeted rooms have more bacteria. So even though they did in this sample, we were afraid of being wrong in that direction. So we set our alpha level fairly low at 0.01. Okay, hope that helps. Let's see how to do this in StatCrunch. A little bit easier because we can pull this data set right in StatCrunch. And I can go to stat, tstat, two sample with data. So I've got carpeted in one and uncarpeted in two. We're looking for one being greater than, and then just press compute. And there we go. We get exactly the same thing we did on the calculator without having to type all the data in. Hope that helps. So it doesn't ask us to do this, but I would feel almost derelict in my duties if we didn't actually do just a quick box plot comparing these two. So sort of a classic way to compare. So our, our me median is more. I can get this to show the mean as well. So let's put a little mean markers on there. So the mean and median are definitely higher for the carpeted, but there's a lot of overlap, isn't there, in our samples. We have some samples here that got kind of high, some here that got fairly low. So we would need to get a bigger sample if 
we had a larger sample, double even, we would probably be able to lower that p-value down if indeed that same ratio held, that same difference held. So I hope that helps.